And welcome back. Well, with more time to read during the summer, it can be fun to get hooked on a series of books like binge reading. Yeah, our favorite book reviewer, Carol Barrowman, is back today with her parents. We have Yay. John and Marion here. Marion's going to be 82 tomorrow. tomorrow. Happy birthday. <laughs> yes. 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 Do we need to have our singer sing to you? Yeah, yeah we need a happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday. That'd be great. Um, and parents of John Barrowman, mm -hmm. Carol's sister, uh, Carol's brother, yep. from Doctor Who, Torchwood, and in the U.S. Arrow. Yeah. Yes. Which a lot of people are familiar That's with. Right. Yes. That's right. Proud parents of, of two amazing kids. Yes, yeah. they certainly are. Yeah. And we're so proud of them. We were the first producers. They were our producers <laughs> first. Yeah. Yeah, the original producers. That's, That's right. right. I guess yes. you both, were you both born in Glasgow? Yes. yes. Okay. And yes. when did you come to America? 76. In 76. Yeah. 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 We came over then because we found we couldn't be king and queen. <laughs> <laughs> so get out of the country. <laughs> Have you, when you talk to people um, who are still in Glasgow, if you still do, do they think that you've lost part of your accent? They do. Yes. Really? They do. Yeah. yeah this is, in fact, a couple of them have said, you have turned really Yankee. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't and they start just really for different, just different and, words that we'd say when, like yeah and yeah. whatever. When we go back there, the first time we went back and we came off the plane and a porter came up to take our luggage and I said to Marion, did we speak like that? <laughs> <laughs> You still do to us. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, and of course, when so. I'm talking to them, I have to speak in my Scottish accent, too, and yeah. I talk to my brother. But they're stars in their own right, because they were on, they toured with John when yeah. he was touring in the UK, and were on stage with him and all of that, and too. And singing. I think yeah, we singing. have video of do it. Do we? Uh -huh. There it is. This is John singing to... He's such a good-looking guy. Do I just think, gotta say. Do we think John could hold his own with Adele? Oh, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you guys dancing. Aww. That is so cute. How long have you been married? 61 years. Six, I like that he yes. knows the answer. Oh, to because question. I told him. <laughs> There they are when they were dating. <laughs> oh, look at yeah. you two. You met in high school, right? Yes. 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 Did you Love like that. her right away? I loved her first. You know, first saw it, I he tripped her yeah. up when she came out of a bathroom so that he would, <laughs> she would get, he could get her attention. <laughs> that was us at a family oh, wedding. That's adorable. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, I he tripped that. her up so that he could get her attention. And, and they're both uh, voracious readers like you. They yes. are, right? Yeah. Yes. Yep, yep. And I think that's kind of, you know, probably where we got it from. The, the good thing is you guys get to read all the books ahead of time. Oh, yes. right. It's fantastic. John reads more than I do. He takes couple of books yeah. and, I'll at once. and I'll say to him what is that your reading tells me and then the next day I'll say what is that other one he says oh I'm doing the two because one's heavy <laughs> and the other one's light so I'm doing the two. So he reads yeah. more than so one he book. Reads yeah, more yeah. than one book at a time. That's yes. the way I am too. Okay here's the thing. I can't yes. just do one. Yeah. I uh, want to ask you guys because my dad does this I'm throwing you under the bus dad he reads the ending first. Oh no. no they are not know. allowed to do that. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> they they, are, they know that. me. They are not. Them. No oh. way. Not allowed to do that. We never do that. So so, Marion, for you, what kind of books do you tend to gravitate towards? Well, the one that I read and I really thought was great was um, Mr. Churchill's um, Secretary. Secretary. Mm -hmm. And it's a series. Okay. And it's just so gripping and you just can't put it down. And the main... And there's the main a, character's a spy, and a the young main woman. character is the spy, and also it gives you a bit of the Second World War, mm -hmm. and awesome. tells you what was going on in London and the UK at that time. Is it so you've accurate? got this, yeah. Yeah, you've got accurate. the spy bit, and then you've got the historical. Uh -huh. So That's it's cool. really good. The yes. most recent release, uh, the new one, is not out until October. That's actually. right. So the Mr. Churchill's so Secretary, wait. a Maggie Hope mystery. Is this one currently out? That one's out? currently out. It's right. Currently out. And it's what's really great. cool is because I happen to have, you know, have connected with the author on social media. She now talks to my mom and makes sure my mom gets a book oh. way ahead oh. of time. Oh. So how many fantastic. in the series are out? There's probably oh. four or five. Yeah. Okay. My dad knows. Okay. Yeah. So the one you're <laughs> recommending right now is Mr. Churchill's Secretary, a Maggie. Hope mystery. Right. That's yes, part in the series. that's yes. it. Yes. Okay. How about for you, John? What do you gravitate towards? I, I read in the summertime. I read some light detective stuff. That's fast read. Stuart Woods is the guy I'm reading at the moment. Okay. And his character throughout the series of books is Stone Barrington, and this guy has gone from being a beat cop 
to now being a, an attorney and a millionaire, two aeroplanes, <laughs> lots of girls. <laughs> <laughs> it's their sexy books. Yeah. And you're fine with that, right, Marion? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm not dead yet. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like also to read stories that involved uh, the Second World War and what happened after the Second World War when they were still trying to promote Nazism. I like reading mm. He likes a Nazi stuff. book. He likes the really? Nazi <laughs> books. I, I, I yeah. don't. Yeah. Interesting. No. Interesting. And it's, it, I also find it interesting that he talks kind of about seasons. Like mm -hmm. in the yes. summer, I like yeah. to that the yeah. people have seasonal preferences as it relates true. to what they, they consume. Heavier you know? books in the winter. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. So that one again was Dishonorable Intentions. Yes. That's the pick for you. Carol, how about yours? Well, I picked um, two books. Um, one of them I recommended in my summer column, and it was Blake Crouch's Dark Matter. I, I'm talking in Scottish now regardless. <laughs> Blake Crouch's Dark Matter, it's out this month and I know I teased you about this a, a while back. You have got to get this book. You are going to be sitting on the beach and get a sunburn because this book, you, can't is, stop. you cannot stop put it down. It's about alternate realities. Dad, you read it. Yes, you I really, did. It was just riveting, a riveting book. And my second one is Lisa Brackman, a wonderful writer and this is a standalone sort of a caper novel. You can't trust anyone in this book. Okay. Like really that. good, really All right, good. We're, we're going to do a giveaway in just a sec. want to make okay. sure people know how to get in touch with Carol because she actually answers emails. Mm -hmm. She talks to our viewers, which is awesome. So chat with just you. that good of a teacher. Yeah. Um, that's what English professors do, apparently. CarolBarrowman.com is the website to visit. She's on Facebook. She's on Twitter. She's on Goodread. And you can also right now call us because we're going to give away the first book that Carol mentioned as her recommendation. This is Dark Matter, which is written by Blake Crouch. Okay, call us at 414-799-4444 because Caller 7 wins. Um, congratulations on 61 years of marriage yes. and happy yes. birthday to yeah. you tomorrow. Thank you very much. We yeah. love yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Carol can bring you every time. Okay. Well, good. Ne next time good. I'll bring John and she and John can have a wee sing song. Together. There we oh, go. Yeah. Yeah. I'm right. all about that. <laughs> Thanks for coming, you guys. It's a pleasure. Thank you. Thank pleasure. You so much. pleasure. We all watch right. every all the time. Oh, we thank you. We That's do. So cool. Even now when we're Carol's go not on. You. Even yeah. when I'm not Carol's on, they watch you. On. <laughs> yes, we still watch Morning Blend. Wow. Fantastic. Love that. That's so Thanks, you guys. We're going to get you a mug, too. Yeah. <laughs> and coffee. <laughs>